This video is sponsored by Google. The colorful Google G logo appears, followed by the Google on Android logo. My name is Lachi. I am a black woman with cornrows. I'm a recording artist and a cultural activist, and I identify as blind. A black woman with braided cornrow hair and a blue flower in her hair wearing a blue and white floral dress and heels walks confidently down a New York City sidewalk with a purple sparkly mobility cane. Lachi's pronouns are she, her. I am a proud New Yorker, and I love going out in my heels and my cane, walking around and being super duper independent in my city. So a lot of people think that blind folks can't do extraordinary things or even ordinary things. At a restaurant, she sits outside at a table and sips from a coffee cup. She unfolds a Google Pixel Fold phone to a text message, receives a photo from a friend, and taps the lookout feature on the photo. The photo expands to cover both screens, and the lookout voice describes the photo. Words appear. Lookout on Google, image queue, and A mode. In this picture, we can see the flower shop, and on the table, we can see flowers. What color are the flowers? The flowers are orange. Lachi sends a response to her friend using voice to text. This sounds cool. We'll check it out. They feel that because of the limitation, that they are limited. Cathedral Parkway. But with the right tools, blind folks can do pretty much anything everyone else can do. She's on the move again, and next, Lachi uses lookout text mode to get information about a street sign. She stops in front of a detour sign and uses text mode to describe it. Pedestrian detour, crosswalk closed, use Manhattan Avenue. We're living in a world where AI is revolutionizing the digital world in a way that can impact the physical world for people with different abilities. Now at the outdoor farmer's market, Lachi picks up a tomato and smells it. She selects some fruits. She uses food labels mode to describe a selection of pies. Lachi uses documents mode to describe a list of weekly specials at a soup vendor and text mode to describe a package label. All specials, butternut squash with pears in. As a blind person, if I'm facing something, I want AI to just be like, you're looking at this. So we don't have to depend on another human being to do it for us. How much is that? That will be $17. So it's really amazing that this technology now exists through Google's Lookout. She purchases a soup and uses Lookout currency mode to identify a $20 bill. $20. Perfect, I should have a 20 for $20. you right there. Google's Lookout allows me to navigate my city independently. In this picture, we can see purple color flowers. She arrives at a flower vendor and takes photos using Lookout's image queue and A mode to answer questions about the flowers. I really love the image question and answer feature. What kind of flowers are in the photo? The flowers are zinnias. It's not just about visual feedback. Now you're getting extra information. Are these sunflowers? Yes, these are sunflowers. People often find it interesting that I love color, that I love bling, <laughs> that I love fashion. But that's what I'm all about. So to be able to have a device that allows me to engage with the beauty and the world around me in that way, it's freeing. She buys sunflowers, then takes a selfie while holding them. She sends the photo and dictates a text. Thanks so much for the recommendation. Loved it. Carrying the flowers, Lachi smiles and spins around as she heads down a sidewalk. The Android logo appears, followed by the colorful Google G logo.